I'm going to put this in motion. Don't focus on specifics here because I'm going to give you a closer view of this in a minute. But just watch how these lows ride up the front and just keep the front from really moving much. So you've got one low moving out and there's another low coming up from the south. And just watch this. This thing is just going to meander as we get into the weekend, at least into Saturday, pushing another wave of rain back our way into Saturday. You can see that there. And then finally on Sunday, it's going to start weakening and pushing off to the east and get just far enough east of us that I think we may be able to squeeze out a dry east Easter Sunday. Technically, there's a very small chance for a shower, but right now we're going to keep it dry for Easter Sunday. That'd be good news. Now, here's that closer view later on this afternoon. Here comes that line of showers and thunderstorms ahead of that cold front that comes through and then big batch of rain comes up with that next low. It could be pouring rain for the morning rush hour tomorrow, so take note of that. And then tomorrow afternoon it breaks up, and so hopefully it's just a couple of showers in the area if you're heading to evening services for Good Friday or you're heading to your Passover Seder tomorrow night. And then we get a bit of a break, and then on Saturday that next low comes up, and here comes the next batch of rain crossing the area during the day. This is midday here, 11 a.m., and then as I showed you on Sunday, things tend to kind of break up and uh, we hopefully will have a dry Easter Sunday. So again, a scattered light shower initially and then a better chance for a shower or thunderstorm later this afternoon, 70 degrees for the high. And again, it will be a breezy afternoon with a wind from the south southwest at 15 to 25 miles per hour. 48 the high tomorrow. We already talked about the weather, so let's just focus on temps. And still cold on Saturday, only 52 for the high. But Sunday we recover into the mid 60s. And again, if we can keep it dry, that would be a reasonably pleasant Easter Sunday, although the grass might be wet for the Easter egg hunt. But rain returns in fits and spurts uh, next week. But notice, we stay into the 60s. And Everod, right now, I think, based on the long-range charts, we are going to be in the 60s to stay all the way through next week.